it's Miss Selena and Miss Carrie. We are so excited you decided to join us today. Today, we are going to hear an Ollie story about the greatest Bible verse ever. Oh, that sounds so exciting, Miss Carrie. It is, Miss Selena. We are so glad that you des- decided to join us today to watch the story together. Are you ready? I'm ready. Great, let's go. A one, two, Sing along with all you got. Here we go. I can love my neighbor because Jesus loves me. I can change the world because Jesus loves me. Sing it again. I can love my neighbor because Jesus loves me. I can change the world because Jesus loves me. play. Oh, Lucy said to talk to it. Um, hello, music player? My name is Melody. That's a cool name. Thank you. 
Uh, Melody, could you please play some music? What kind of music? Uh, p please play some dance music. Playing dance music? This is so fun! I can dance so many ways to this music. I can dance like this. Or this. I can even dance like this. Whew. Melody, you can stop now. I'm danced out. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Having a dance party, are you? Hi, Ollie. I sure am. I'm having so much fun dancing to our new music player. That's a fun way to dance. It's true. I've got even more reasons to dance for you. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. my best dog, Stormy Jane. We are celebrating today because God loves us. Now, how can we trust that God loves us? Well, that's our story today. Are you ready, Stormy? <laughs> She's ready. Are you ready? Then let's go. Can anyone tell me what this is? It's a heart, yes. And today's true story begins with God's love for you. Do you know how much God loves you? Hold your hands up like this. God loves you so much. So, so much. So, so, so much. So much. Stretch your hands out wide. God loves you so much that I can't even show you how much it is. Yes, God's love for us is so, so big. <sighs> Good job. You can put your hands down. Oh, now look at this. Do you know what this is? Yep, it's the earth where we live. And it's full of millions and millions of people. And God loves each and every one. You could live here or um, oh, over here or well, even here. And God would love you because he loves everyone in the whole wide world. But how do we know God loves us? It's because he gave us this is very exciting. Let's get out our pretend party trumpets. Do this with me. Let's announce the surprise. Ready? A gift. God loves us so much. He gave us a very special gift. The best gift of all. Are you ready? The gift was Jesus. Yes, Jesus is the most special gift. Jesus is God's son, and he came to be our friend forever. So let's put it all together, ready? God loved the world so much, he gave us Jesus. You know what, let's say that together. Repeat after me. God loved, God loved the world so much, the world so much, he gave us, he gave us Jesus, Jesus. <laughs> Good job, you guys. We can trust God loves us because God gave us the best gift, Jesus, to be our friend forever. I can trust God and you can trust God. Hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who can trust God? I can trust God. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me. Who can trust God? I can trust God. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story. And it's all true. God gave us Jesus. So you can trust he loves me and you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? 
Wow, God loves us so much that he gave us Jesus to be our friend forever. And that means we can always trust God. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did say, got it, get it? Got it! Good! I want to celebrate that God gave us Jesus. It makes me feel like dancing again. Melody, can you please play some really fast dance music? Playing dance music? I'll see you guys next time. Bye! God, I am not afraid. Psalm 5611. I trust in God. I am not afraid. Psalm 5611. Our Bible story today was about a very special baby who grew up to do amazing things only he can do. Who is the special baby God gave us? Jesus! Yes, God gave us Jesus. And because God loves us so much, he gave us Jesus and we can totally trust him. And that's why the new Bible verse we'll learn this month says, I can trust in God, I am not afraid. Psalm 5611. When we remember that God loves us so much He gave us Jesus, we can say, I can trust in Jesus. Let's say the Bible verse together with the motions. We'll teach you, okay friends? Just say what we say and do what we do. I trust, trust in God. And I'm not afraid. Psalm 5611. Great job. Should we do it one more time? Definitely. I think so. I trust in God. I am not afraid. Psalm 56, 11. You sound so great. Now that we know we can trust God, when I say, who can trust God, I want you to say, I can trust God. Ready? Let me hear you. Who can trust God? I can trust God. Who can trust God? I can trust God. You sure can, and you can too, Miss Carrie. God loves you and me and Miss Selena so much that he gave us his son, Jesus, to be our friend forever. That's right, Miss Carrie. Would you like to pray so we can thank God for giving us his son to be our friend forever? Yes. God, thank you for giving us Jesus, and thank you that he is our friend, and thank you that we can trust you. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye, friends. Bye. See you next week.